Thank you very much. And good afternoon. It's a pleasure for me to be here and to talk on a topic that I know you might think does not concern you. But the world is a global village. And because of this, I think we have issues that are connected. I have been here for the past three weeks, meeting with different people, politicians, activists, and I have listened to different discussions. I have come to realize that we have similar issues, issues that actually and really need a change. You talk about the wall that used to divide Berlin. You talk about wars. We still have a wall as African women. A wall that we cannot church. A wall that we cannot see. But a wall that we can feel. And this wall is what we are trying to break. As you have done in your own efforts to break the Berlin Wall. You have done it physically. And we are doing it emotionally through education. This wall is what we call female genital mutilation. As you have taboos that you are not allowed to talk about, so is female genital mutilation. This is an issue that we, as women, are not allowed to talk about. But we think it's time to break the wall and free ourselves from this harmful practice that killed women silently in Africa. Women ran from Africa to seek freedom in Europe, to seek freedom in the Western countries. And we think we have to stay in Africa to fight for this freedom. And this is why we talk about the issue of female genital mutilation. Female genital mutilation has kept women quiet. The whole process has rituals that you cannot understand. You can only see, but you cannot feel. And we as Africans do not want people to pity because we go through this harm. We want people to join us to fight against the continuation of this harmful traditional practice. Female genital mutilation has actually promoted so many issues in our continent. It is the source of early marriage. It is the source of teenage pregnancy. And it is the source of high infant mortality rates. So we think with education, we can liberate our minds. With education, we can change the way we think. With education, we can change perception. And that's why today, we join you to reflect on the wall that you have broken. So that together as Africans, we can also reflect and see the way forward to break the barrier. So we can celebrate our sexuality as the Western women are doing. So continue to support us so we can celebrate together. I thank you. Vielen herzlichen Dank.